You may remember the First Lady and President Biden visited Ottawa just a few weeks ago, announcing the new immigration deal that closes illegal border crossings, like the one at Roxham Road. Tens of thousands of asylum seekers have used to enter Canada in recent years. That new agreement took several months of negotiations between the U.S. and Canada. Frederick Gagneau, who is a political science professor and the director of the Centre for the Study of the United States at the University of Quebec at Montreal, says the deal likely wouldn't have happened if the Trump administration were still in power. Uh, and if Trump were president right now, I think it might have been more difficult for Trudeau to negotiate a deal to close uh, Roxham Road. We know it's a very important issue here in the area, in the area of Plattsburgh. Uh, Trump would probably still be attacking Trudeau personally or Canada's unfair trade practices on social media and in public. Gagneau was the guest speaker in a virtual webinar hosted by the Center for the Study of Canada at SUNY Plattsburgh. Gagneau says the former president's anger over tariffs and his contentious relationship with the prime minister would have likely kept the two countries from reaching an agreement on immigration. You can watch that full webinar from the Center for the Study of Canada on our website and YouTube channel.